Hello and welcome back to my channel, the place for entrepreneurs, nomads, and travelers. In today's video, I'm going to introduce you to Dades Gorge and Valley in Morocco. Now, this is a breathtaking valley in Morocco that should definitely be on your list of places to visit. If you are an outdoor enthusiast, you're going to love today's videos. Let's get started with the seven reasons to visit Dades Gorge and Valley. Number one, it's an absolutely stunning drive through the valley to the gorge. Number two, the canyon walls are 600 to 1600 feet high. Number three, it's ideal for hiking, rock climbing, and rafting. Number four, it's off the beaten path and you'll avoid a lot of the touristy places. Number five, it's budget friendly. Number six, it's a real Moroccan experience. And by that, I mean, you're not gonna find a ton of tourists. Number seven, and my personal favorite, Monkey Fingers Hike you're in for a treat and I'm going to show you everything you need to know about hiking the monkey fingers. In this short video, my goal is to show you what makes Dades Valley so special and hopefully you'll take the time to visit it while you're in Morocco. Let's get started. When is the best time to visit Dades Gorge? From a weather standpoint, the best months are March through May and September through November. I visited in January and while it can be cool and you might find a little bit of snow, it was still beautiful and enjoyable. What was my highlight of Dades Gorge? Well, I'm an outdoor enthusiast, so I really enjoyed the hiking, and my favorite part was hiking monkey fingers. The start of the hike is really fun as you wind through some tight spaces, and I really enjoy the scrambles. I could easily spend a week or two hiking in and around Dades Gorge and Valley. Where is the best place to stay? One of the best hikes in the gorge is called Monkey Fingers, and I selected an Airbnb close to the hike. If you want to stay in the same place, look for the Airbnb link in the description. It was a nice Airbnb with a good breakfast and walking distance to the starting point. Tell me about the Monkey Fingers hike. Well, the Dades Gorge and Monkey Fingers Canyon Loop is a 10 kilometer lightly trafficked loop trail. It's very scenic and carries a difficult rating because it involves a few scrambles and a little bit of climbing. No special gear is needed and when I went in the winter, there was one section that offered a choice of getting wet or a fun little scramble and I opted for the scramble. If you're not used to doing any scrambling, this trail might not be for you. This hiking trail is accessible year round. How do I find the Monkey Fingers hike? Well, I'm glad you asked. You want to use the free maps.me app because the app shows hiking trails. Here's the map and I've marked the trail you want. The start of the trail can be a little hard to find, but with the app, you'll have no problem. And I'll make sure I include a picture where you can see a boulder that you have to walk under. If you walk under that boulder, you'll know you're on the right trail. And if you appreciate this type of information, then smash that like and subscribe button. Is there a trail guide available? Yes, if you ask the Airbnb where I stayed, they can refer a guide and the cost is 200 dirhams. But I really don't think one is necessary, especially if you're hiking at your own pace and taking lots of photos. With the Maps.me app, I think you'll be covered. Is it safe to hike in Dades Valley? I've traveled all over the world and for what it's worth, I found hiking and doing outdoor activities away from the big cities to be completely safe in Morocco. Everyone we encountered was cheerful and happy. And when we went in the winter, there weren't a lot of people hiking, but still, not a problem at all. Do I have any other advice for Dottie's Gorge? Well, Dottie's Gorge is pretty much a self-guided tour and you can drive as much or as little of the gorge as you like. It is beautiful and there are countless opportunities for pictures or stopping to enjoy the small restaurants along the way. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to check out my other videos on Morocco where I covered Ait Bin Adou, luxury camping in the Sahara Desert at Merzouga, Chef Shawin, Morocco's Blue City, Todra Gorge, Marrakech, and my complete expense breakdown for my 12 days in Morocco. If you want me to keep producing these videos, then give me some YouTube love with a like, subscribe, and share. I'm still trying to figure out if there's a demand for this type of video, which is why your YouTube likes and subscribes is important feedback for me. When I look at all of the other travel videos on YouTube, I see some good videos, but rarely does anybody share the types of details like I did for the Monkey Fingers hike. This is the type of information I want, and hopefully you wanted it as well. While you give me your like, comment, and subscribe, here's some cool Berber music from my Sahara Luxury Camping in Merzouga. That's an awesome video and bucket list item that you want to do. Be sure to check it out. 